morning in this skill station uh, uh, we are going to discuss uh, in case of tension pneumothorax how to relieve the tension with the uh, uh, middle decompression so first uh, uh, i would like to tell you about the signs and symptoms of tension pneumothorax what is tension pneumothorax when air is trapped inside the pleura through the space uh, that is basically called a pneumothorax it can be open pneumothorax or closed one uh when lot of tension is creating in that because of air trapping inside the chest and this air is pressurizing the other others this condition is called tension pneumothorax in tension pneumothorax you will have upset bricks on the one side there will be sudden chest there will that chest will not participate into the ventilation it will be shiny skin and then uh when you are percutting it then you will get a high deepening node on the percussion trachea may be deviated on the other side because lot of tension is been creating uh, you will have a uh, raised chevini and there may there might be absence of a pulse of other side because the tension so uh, all these are basically the sign of tension pneumothorax now how to relieve a tension for a relieving a tension you need to have a large bore iv cannula or a large bore needle that you need to have with this needle you can uh, relieve the tension so where uh, to put this cannula you need to put the cannula in second intercostal space how to find a second intercostal space suppose there is a tension on a you know uh, there is a tension pneumothorax on a, a left side so what to do uh, in a clavicle you need to identify the mid clavicular line and just below the clavicle you will palpate a rib that rib will be the second rib because first rib is a hidden rib uh, behind the clavicle so the for so the immediate rib after the clavicle you will find that is the second rib and in between the second rib and third rib the space is called second intercostal space now there are a lot of uh, 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 vessels and nerves and bundles that everything is present below the rib so you need not to puncture below the second rib you need to puncture above the third rib in a mid clavicular line second intercostal space above third rib there you will puncture so uh, i'll also make an uh, uh, seal uh, so that you will understand that uh, the air is coming out and it is not again pushing back so what do you need you need to have this uh, any uh, you know saline bottle i'm having a dns over here and then you need to have a iv set so how to make a circuit it's very simple you can create the circuit by cutting this chamber and you can insert this tube directly inside this bottle you can remove it this no use of this or you may close it if you want to put so anyway we are making this seal now this the seal is ready right now <clears throat> what to do in the next step now you need to identify on uh, some few landmarks So see, so this is a clavicle. Just below the clavicle, you will find a second rib, uh, either of the side, right? So suppose the tension is on the right side, then you need to puncture on the right side. So how to do that? So this is a second rib, and this is second intercostal space. This is third rib. So in a mid clavicular line, third rib, right here, you are going to puncture it. in a perpendicular manner in a perpendicular manner you are pressing it at 90 degree angle okay and then you need to connect the seal
can't see the ear. Here you can see the ear is coming. So this will create a seal so that the ear is not going back into the, uh, into the uh, lung cavity. So this is a temporary measure while your uh, permanent uh, definitive solution of ICD can be done. So this is an emergency procedure. This is an emergency procedure and uh, before you know if uh, tension pneumothorax is there. So definitely patient may die because uh, there is no space for heart to beat or uh, you know there is no space for uh, 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 there is a venous return, there is no venous return, there is no cardiac output. So if you relieve the tension definitely it will uh, open up all the organs and then circulation will again happen and by the time you can uh, put the ICD also. Again, again telling you this needle thoracostomy is an emergency procedure meanwhile you arrange for the definitive ICD. So if you are having a patient who is having tension pneumothorax, you don't have any other things available, just relieve the tension by putting a needle and connecting to a water seal. If you didn't connect the water seal, what will happen, it will convert into an open pneumothorax. So the moment the patient sucks in air, the air will go from the atmosphere into the lung cavity. So for that we make a seal. It's very easily any ICU, any ward, everything, everywhere these things are available. Thank you Dr. Ravin Thank you for this useful tip. Thank you.